Hello there guys and welcome, it is Niran here and today it is time for episode 0 of my new series The Career Mode Project on FIFA 15 Next Gen on Xbox One, my first Next Gen series and so what I'm going to do is explain this because it's a little bit vague and mysterious from the title uh, of the series. Now what this is going to be is in, in effect an experiment, it's all well and good seeing the, uh, the the potential, the statistical potential of some of the players, but sometimes you actually want to see a practical viewing of it. You actually want to see each of the individual attributes for some of the young players. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be taking some young players, putting them into a team, and actually simming through the full 15 seasons of career mode so you'll be able to see their attributes as we go along. Now that won't be it, we'll actually be seeing some of the highlights, some of the goals, and some of the other things that they do during the series as well as some of the other players that you actually want to see um you know want to view the stats of as well so at the end of each episode i'll give you the opportunity to comment for players that you would like to see involved in the next episode that don't actually belong to the team as you can see in the background is the team that we are going with there's players like divok origi hakan kaljanoglu we've also got rafa goretzka there sule at the back simone scuffe and other players who are really good potential players uh, at the moment you're going to see their stats and some of their information in the background as well just whilst i talk to you about the series a little bit more there you can see simone scuffe the 71 stats italian i'm going to be taking on red bull salzburg and that's because it doesn't take too long to sim through the season because there's only 10 teams in that league so we're going to be going through some of the players stats as well you can see Jimenez the centre back who actually plays for Atletico Madrid in real life uh, in the description you'll be able to find the information about all of the players involved in this series every single episode and yeah basically I'll just be showing you some of the best highlights some of the best clips throughout the season of these players as they get better and just give you a chance to actually see what players potential is like a lot further into the career mode because sometimes we don't have time you know you might be in your fifth season of career mode looking for some players who are very good by the fifth season of career mode and hopefully this will be able to help you with that i'm hoping it's going to be a very exciting series I'm going to be doing some you know showing off some new graphics and all that sort of thing and actually getting used to next gen as well there you can see hakan kalyanoglu will probably be the main man in this series and we'll go through some of the other players as well when it goes into a squad report in a moment's time there's also a subs bench as well with some other younger players as well you may have seen a few guys like paul nardi the goalkeeper who plays in France for AS Nancy, I do believe, unless he has changed team. Uh, but yeah, as I say, all the information for the players will be in the description below. So the next uh, episode of this will probably be in about a week's time. This will be a sort of weekly thing. Uh, all the information for the players will be in the description. And of course, you can drop uh, your suggestions for players you would like to see in the others section, as I will call it, in the comments section as well. So I think I've pretty much covered everything this series is going to be about. Um, you can almost you can almost describe it as a career mode team builder, I suppose, but that career mode team builder sort of has a third dimension. You actually get to see them grow and their potential actually increase as well. I just hope it's very it's, it's very informational for you guys as well. There you can see Divock Origi, who will be playing up front, and there's Nathan Redmond. The other winger, I do believe, is Rafa, um, who plays for SC Braga, I do believe. And you'll see the bench as well in a moment. There's got guys like Paul Nardi, there you can see, as well as Khan Ihan of Schalke there. Uh, Hoberg, who plays for Bayern Munich. Then we've got Patrick Roberts of Fulham. Dali Sinkgraven for Hin and Veen. Ricardo Kishner of Ajax there. And as you can see there on the screen, Brill Donald M. Bolo of Basel. There you can see the reserves as well. Kodzi Yanazov. I don't even know. He plays for Zenit St. Petersburg. And I think he's from Uzbekistan. But he's under the left back as well there. He's got some decent potential in the game. Dongu Safak there, the striker from Barcelona. As well as Fares Bahluli, Lazaro, Ondoa and also Lucas Hernandez playing for Atletico Madrid. So I'm fairly sure I've explained everything by now. We'll basically be looking at a ton of stats for some of the players. But that of course won't be it. It won't just be all stats, don't worry. It will be mainly gameplay. Mainly some of the screamer goals that these guys score once they reach their potential. Just think about the potential of this of this team. Just think about how good they will be after 15 seasons. Absolutely awesome, and that's what I'm looking forward to. There you can see, as we now move on to the squad report, though, to see some of the stats. We've got Fabrice Ondoa there, the goalkeeper, 62 stat and 18 years of age, I think, as well. We've got Hal Cancelo, Nicolas Sula there, Jose Maria Jimenez, Nicolas Muru. Feel free to stop and look at any of these stats as we go along as well there. Leon Goretzka, Ruben Neves, Hakan Kaljinoglu there of FC Bayer Leverkusen. And then we've got Nathan Redman there of Norwich. Divock Origi, the 75 stat 19 year old there playing for Lille. Ricardo Kishner, the very skillful Ajax winger. Brill Donald Embola, the strong and pacey striker from Basel. Patrick Roberts of Fulham. Dali Sinkgraven, the playmaker from Hinnenbeam. Pierre Emil Hoberg of Bayern Munich. Then Valentino Lazaro. All of these players with some fantastic stats to say they're so young. Khan Ihan there. Paul Nardi, the other goalkeeper. Lucas Hernandez there. 
of Atletico Madrid, Simone Scuffe of Udinese in reality, then we've got that guy, Kodzianalias of, I haven't, I haven't even got a clue if I pronounced that right, Rafa there, Faraz Bartolulli, got Jean-Marie Dongu, Safak as well, and uh, yeah, just some awesome players, it has to be said. Hopefully the uh, the potential of these guys will be huge, and I'm really, really looking forward to seeing these guys at the end of the career mode. I hope you guys are as well. If you've got any suggestions on how to make this series a lot better, because I understand I may not have explained it very well, you'll see a lot better in, in episode one how it's going to go down. I'll show you the stats of all these players at the end of season one, and then show you the highlights of what they did in that season, just to show you, just to see, show you how they progress across the seasons in how they play and the actual attributes that they have as well. But feel free to leave a like if you enjoyed this uh, this sort of announcement video, I suppose. I did hope you enjoyed, and I hope you grasp the scenario and grasp what this series is actually going to be about. I'm quite excited about it. I haven't done a new series in quite some time, so feel free to leave a like if you did enjoy. Comment about enjoying it if you enjoyed that much, as well as who you would like to see in the other players section in terms of players who aren't currently in the Red Bull Salzburg squad that we are running with, and uh, I will show the stats of those guys at the end of the episode, the first episode, or first official episode of this series so yeah subscribe if you're new around here as well it's been a pleasure to see you guys today have a good day enjoy yourselves and goodbye